Good morning, everybody! My name is Mathis, and welcome back to some more Stardew Valley. It's been a few days, um, and I'm not gonna belabor you with a million excuses. I'm just gonna put it pretty simply. Um, Mike, I've been having, outside of like my normal workload, uh, the past few days, I've been having computer issues. And when I have computer issues, which doesn't happen very often, maybe two or three times a year, you know, I wish it didn't happen ever, but two or three times a year. Um, right then, like, my, my computer has to take precedence. It absolutely has to. Uh, and if that means losing recordings and limiting my recordings to m maybe two videos a day instead of three or four, and I have to cut certain things, then so be it. And, uh, the, this is just the, the series that ended up, I ended up cutting. Um, it's not for any other reason other than uh it just is what ended up being what my decision it's it's it is what it is and I, I apologize and i understand you know there are people who are upset uh that i cut the series i understand you're upset i well there's, there's nothing else i can do uh other than say i'm sorry um but it needed to be done and uh that's i i stand by that it absolutely 100 percent needed to happen i needed to make sure Everything is going to be okay, and for right now, things are all right. Um, we do have ourselves uh, a, a computer that's working for now, though I am working on making... Like, I'm, I'm still watching it and making sure things are going to be okay. I don't want to really go into, like, details to what's going on with it, because we're still semi in the troubleshooting phase, in that we're trying to figure out exactly what the issue is. Luckily, I have awesome friends um, who did IT for a living. Uh, big shout out to Sinvicta. He's just a good guy all the way around, always willing to help whenever shit goes down. Uh, this is not the first time I've had computer issues and uh, he's been like ready and waiting to help anytime something goes down. He's always ready to step up. The dude is just a class act and I appreciate that um, greatly. He's just a good guy. So thank you Sinvicta for helping me out. But right now we're working on things at the same time. I have to admit, too, that my computer is getting up there in age. Now, normally, um, we only got one star fruit seed out of that star fruit seed that we put in there. That's unfortunate. Um, now, as I was saying, un uh, my, my computer is getting a little on the older side. That's what I was, that's what I was trying to say. Um, it's about three or four years old now at this point, which is for the most for any normal computer not that old um it's not an old computer at all but my computer and people in my profession it's just part of the job uh that that can be kind of old my computer is working almost 24 7. the thing is almost always doing something whether at night maybe it's rendering something overnight or i'm recording or whatever very very uh, it, very often it's doing something and so it's always being put through the ringer it's always being put to work and it's just always uh you know it's it's, it's basically I'm, I'm basically stressing the computer as often as i can trying desperately to get the most out of it and working it all the time it just comes with the job that's just how this job works i'm not complaining it just it is what it is what that does mean is that after a couple of years, computers, you know, putting it as, working as much and as often as I am, things can start to break. Um, and every four or five years, you know, it, it, we're always looking to maybe replace uh, what we've got going on and, and, and whatnot just to, to, to do that. And we're getting to the point right now, at least I'm getting to the point right now, where it's about time to start looking at replacing my rig uh, and getting a new rig and uh, making things fresh and shiny. I'm not ready. I'm not quite there yet. I'm not. I really don't want to yet because I, it's just a pain in the ass <laughs> to get all my programs switched over. But that 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 may be something we should. I, I, I'm something I I am already readily looking into um, and looking at my options as to what I should be doing and what kind of computer I want to be building. Um, but man, you know, I used to, my, my computers back when I didn't do this would last me six, seven, eight years sometimes with, without any issue. Um, but once I started doing this, it became apparent, you know, every few years you need to make a, a pretty hefty investment in a pretty beastly rig. And that's the other thing too. You want, you want a good rig. You want a really powerful computer when you're doing this because man, 
you are going to be playing and recording at the same time quite often or you know editing rendering videos just putting your your processor through a lot of, it's just a lot i know i feel like i'm rambling and i am rambling but you know it is what it is i'm not bitching i don't want anybody to think i'm whining like oh i have it so hard this job is so difficult that's not what i'm saying um and what i am saying though is that does it just means that's every once in a while i am i'm gonna have computer issues that i have to deal with so anyway, that's why you haven't seen any any videos, and I apologize. I do wish that it hadn't happened, but it did, and it do, so whatever. Okay. What do we got going on right now? Uh, I don't remember. It's been, I think, six days since last I played. So I am a little bit, I don't want to say lost, but I don't quite remember what was going on. It is... Thursday, um, which is good. I want to give Abby a gift if I can catch her. There she is. There we go. Um, I don't really have anything. Uh, sorry, I wasn't hitting on your daughter, ma'am. No, no, I wasn't definitely not hitting on your daughter at all. Nope. Hey, how's it going, professor? Things get pretty lively at night? I mean... For a small town, kinda, sure. A little bit. Hey, Penne! What up, baby grill? Would you like some mayonnaise? Nope, I've already given you two gifts. Never mind. I guess I'm not gonna give you none of that mayo. Girl! Would you like... Alright, well, you like... Listen, you like driftwood, you freaking weirdo! So I figured you might enjoy, like, some pine tar resin or something, you know? Things that come from trees. Out, and if, if there is a person out there who collects driftwood and has, like, a passion for driftwood. You're not a weirdo, I, pr I promise. You're neat. I like you. Keep watching my videos, thanks. Um, we're gonna go to the wizard. And I'm gonna give him some essence of the void. That's why I actually brought void and all the other stuff. It's kind of my way to remind myself, hey... Go visit the wizard. Go visit Mr. Wizard. Alright. Down we go. Getting real lucky. We get, we get at least, like, it seems like two berries every single time. That may be just standard. And I'm just dumb and don't realize it's standard. But it does feel like... Maybe it is. Maybe it is standard. Yeah, looking like maybe out of these bushes, it's standard. If we see blackberries just lying on the floor, I think we get if we get two, we're lucky. But I think getting two out of these bushes is, is bog standard. At, and I'm just dumb and don't realize it. Okay. I also have been looking at some layouts of some monster farms. I have a good idea as to what I want to do, or at least some themes that I like. Wait, wait a minute. Thought I saw something in the trees up there. Uh, definitely saw some themes that I liked. There you go. And beauty with potent arcane and very useful. Thank you. Anyway, so the themes that I like that I'm going to be using when uh when I start expanding and, and fixing and changing things. So um, we'll be looking forward to that. Soon we'll have our horse, which will be awesome. Faku will be returning, which will be super sweet. No rain, unfortunately, so we can't fish for that last fish that we need that we can get during the fall months. Uh, other than that, it's just kind of your usual stuff that we've been doing. Nothing super duper special. I don't. Let's see if we got any. Got any hats going on here? Any new hats, anyway? Let's find out. Hello. Do you have any new hats? I mean, you have a lot of hats. The good old cap. Man, you have a lot of hats. The official, the official cap, blue bonnet. I kind of like the good old cap a little bit. But none of them, like, scream, I must have this. I kind of like the, the hat that I've got going, the hat that I've been using for so long at this point. It's part of me, man. It's part of who I am. I'm also forging berries like crazy. 
all for the forging skill, but also because money. Like this is actually some decent cash. This is like an entire day's work though, is forging all this nonsense. I kind of wish that the berries auto attracted to me. Like as soon as I shake them from the bush, I wouldn't have to like make sure that I walk close enough where they are attracted this particular direction. I kind of wish the game would just be like, yeah, you clicked the bush, it's good enough. But no, it's not how it works. May want to chop some of these trees down for some wood. Good. Yeah, let's get rid of one. Just gonna strip farm all these logs. Sorry, game. I'm anti nature in that regard, I guess. Hey, thanks for the two whopping copper. Oh boy! I've never felt so rich in my life until this very day where I got two copper out of the ground. How awesome. 610. I hope we get Faku tomorrow. That would be swell. Do I want to get another cow? Well, I missed my opportunity to do so. But getting four cows may be what I should be doing here. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you know what else we should do while we're here? Again, it's been a, a few days, so my my memory of like my schedule is uh has got to slowly come back to me. But we should go get the hardwood that we've been farming pretty reliably too for the past few days. Let's keep that going. See you later. I'm gonna try and give the cake to the statue. See if he likes like. That particular thing. My mom sent me a cake. Been hanging on to it. Seeing if maybe I want to give it to the statue over here. Maybe he'll take it. Die. Die. I mean, you jumped at me and that was kind of just a gigantic fail. Thank you. I'm just glad that these things freaking. Always respawn. Every single day, tr tree trunks are just here for some reason, and I don't know why. Okay. Beautiful. I will. Let's go see if he'll take this. Kind of hope he will, but we'll see. Hello, sir. I come... No. 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 Would you like the cake? No. Alright, well. One day, I'm gonna know what you want to eat, man. It's gonna be a fantastic day. I'll tell you what. Let's go for a fish. Let's do some fishing! Right by the green slime. He can watch me from behind. Cause he's a green old slime. Yeah, it's green slime. I think I need the wood skip for something, you know that thing about it? No, I sold the eel like a moron cause I thought I already gave the eel over. Aw, oh, fucking dick, dang it. I'm an idiot. Wood skip. Okay, that's good. We need that for a bundle. Don't sell it. Why did I sell the eel? Mathis. You freaking fracker. Why would you do that, man? That was dumb. Well. I thought I, I swear I thought I donated that. Uh, I should have double checked anyway, just to make sure. I should never just assume that I've done something. Because I'm dumb enough to not have done it. <sighs> Whatever, man. Hey, Mathis. You're an idiot. Hey, Mathis. Could you be any dumber? Why, yes. Yes, I could. 
I could be stupider than you. Oh boy. You have no idea. Farmer Mathis. I would look good in some suspenders, I'm telling you. I betcha I would look super good. Now yeah, I want to keep that. I don't know why I'm keeping that purple forage mushroom. In my mind, I'm like, I need this for something. Don't be stupid. You need this for something. Don't be stupid. But I don't know if I actually do need it for anything, really. Okay. Well, let's see if we make some good money. Maya? Yeah, money. Yeah, honey. Yeah, making damn money, honey. <laughs> Frick yeah, dog. You still making my shit? No, I got Faku, dog. Yeah. Come by the shop and check out the new rods I'm selling. They're the best money you can buy, and you can customize them with different kinds of tackle. Hell yeah. Oh, this is the day. The day I've been waiting for. This is the day I've been waiting for. Waiting for this day. Yes, I've been waiting for this day. So we need the yam in there. But no quality them. All right, we gotta get some pumpkinos up. Faku, what up, Boo? No, you're not. You're not Grover. We ride the Faku. Boom, baby. Daddy loves you. You stay right there, all right? Hello, chickens. We have Faku again, yes. I forgot to sell that for some reason. No. There we go. Okay, Faku, for whatever reason, I can't ride you while putting eggs in the thing. That's fine. I'm not gonna be mad about it. I don't particularly care all that much. Just saying, it's a pain in the ass. Hello. Love you, love you, love you. Let me milk your titties. TT City! Thank you. Daddy loves Titty City. It's Daddy's favorite place. Okay. Beautiful. Alright. What's the next thing I want to do here? Well, we need to sell what we didn't sell yesterday, so let's do that. We want to buy the new fishing pole. Um, we're gonna sell that and that. I'm gonna hang on to that. Sell those, those, those. Okay. Boom. We need to donate. Whoa. You are running... Are you running faster? Or is your animation just all fucking weird? Oh, your animation is just fucked up. All right, that's fine. I'm not gonna bitch about it. You're just, it's really weird that your animation is like quadruple the speed it should be. No big complaints. I'm just saying it's really strange. Faku, are you on Coke again? Listen, man. The reason you were gone at the beginning is because I sent you off to rehab. Come on, man, be strong. I'm here for you. Shit, I sold my eggplants. And I need them. Damn it. <laughs> Alright, the other thing we're gonna do is we're gonna buy ourselves 32 pumpkin seeds. We're gonna grow, we're gonna grow some more pumpkinos. Have I given Abby all her gifts this week? I have. Good enough for me. Okay. 
So let's go plant these pumpkarino seeds. And then... I forgot to donate the other... Dumb... Stupid... Damn thing. Excuse me. Coming through. My name is Mathis, and I'm coming through. Specialty, specialty. Boom. Hell yeah. Oh, fuck it. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Places to be, places to go. Look at Fucker run. He's so fast, he's not slow. He really feels like his animation is fucked, however. And I don't know I don't know why. Okay, but we're back on our farm, it's normal. Yo, Faku, what's going on, dog? One, two, three. Did you like that singing, by the way? It was pretty sweet, right? I don't know. I hope 32 is the right number. Yep, it is. I don't know how I remembered that. I just kind of did. All right, Faku. Here we go, dog. We're going to go back to Wizard Man. And we're going to hook him up. With the essence of the sun. The solar essence, of course. It's what they call it here in uh, Stardew Valley Town. It's, uh, it's colloquially, colloquially known. Collo colloquially known as a uh, solar essence. Yo, what up, dude? Nice skateboard. What up? Can I do some kick flips? I can hook you up, man. I've got mayonnaise. I don't get it. I mean, I tried to get it. Oh, his animation's back to normal. Alright, I don't know what the hell's going on. Maybe Faku was just having, like... A, like, I don't know. A flash Flashback to his coke days or something? I don't... I don't know. Hey, girl! What you got? You have a coconut. I'm gonna buy that. I don't know if it's particularly good. Um, but I'm taking it. I'm gonna take your maple syrup. Okay. Thanks. I don't know if the coconut's at all useful. Maybe I can plant it on the beach and it'll grow? Like, Animal Crossing style? Hello, sir. Yes. Potent magical energies. Do you like? Wait, wizard man, you don't have any hearts for me? Wizard man, the fuck? How do you have no freaking anything for me? God damn it. Why you not like my solar essence? I don't know what I'm doing. Listen, it's been a very stressful few days. Thanksgiving happened while I was away, and now it's family is always fucking stressful, you know what I'm saying? Uh... Then my computer, you know, obviously shitting out on me. Things are difficult here in Mathatown. Just saying. Feel bad for me, son. I got 99 problems, but you ain't one. Hey, oh, love my viewers. Am I right? Am I right? Boop, boop. Gathering hardwood. Got your hardwood right here. It's in my pants. Penis joke. Penis joke. Do you get it? It's a penis joke. Oh god, slime! No, slime! Wait, you're barely doing any damage to me, but still. I don't appreciate it. Just like you didn't appreciate my penis joke! Hey oh! All you underage fans, I hope you're wearing headphones so your parents don't hear it. Ooh, raunchy math is in the house. What you gonna do? Really nothing. Maybe get in trouble. I, th I probably... Oh, that's a good question. 
I say I, I was gonna say I probably would have gotten in trouble, but I don't know if that's true. I was quite sheltered as a child. That was just I was the firstborn of three, and the firstborn is notoriously sheltered most of the time. Not all the time, but most of the time. Uh, while the youngest is like my, the parent, my parents or most parents at that point have had experience. They know what you can do and what you can't do, and uh, you know you can let the the youngest get away with more. But I was I was super sheltered as a child, but I don't know, it's hard because I grew up in a time where the YouTube and the internet in general wasn't a thing. I remember getting the internet for the first time, dial-up, AOL style, baby, where you could pay by the hours. Um, instead of paying for like a plan. Like, I don't I don't know. Would I have gotten in trouble? That is an interesting question. I mean, porn and stuff got me in trouble when I was in my mid-teens, when that was a thing. Not not like, you know, magazine porn, but like internet porn. But if I listen to like, raunch, like a raunchy YouTuber, I'm not saying I'm raunchy, but a YouTuber that made stupid dick jokes like I do, would I have gotten in trouble? I would like to say, there's probably like a 75% chance that I would not have gotten in trouble. But I'm 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 uh, I'm not a hundred percent certain, so there's still a part of me that thinks maybe yeah, I would have gotten in trouble. Um, iridium rod. We might as well buy it and just use that for now. From now on. Um, there we go. We got the iridium rod, so we can catch fish easier now. We can add, like, tackle to it as well. Oops, Jesus. But it also makes other fish easier to catch. I'm pretty sure. I mean, that wasn't hard, but I don't think it was a particularly hard fish to catch in general, so I'm not gonna be like, oh! Do you see what I'm talking about? Is that something I can scoop up? Is that new? Why did that look different? I saw it twitching. But it didn't look like normal wormies. Matt, this is a confused boy. This could be closed. Which means we'd have to do it tomorrow. It's not, though. Hey, boo. I got an ornamental fan. There you go. You're welcome. It wasn't worms. It was like purple monsters twitching out of the ground. You know what I'm saying, fam? All right. Well, there's not much we can do with time left, only because it's late in the day. Too late in the day to go to the... Uh, to the caves. Um, we've been doing a lot of just kind of prep work, but we have Faku, and he's back. And I'm happy he's back after his rehab. Uh, he needed it, you know. So no, no harm in getting help. Get help if you need it. Uh, but now that he's back, we can start riding him around, which is great. A little bit faster. I think we made some good money. And let's just don't, or don't, not donate, but sell off everything we do not need here and is that it okay cool and we'll say thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed if you did let me know in the comment section below by hitting the like button and as always i'll see all of you next time Bye bye